Suspected metal thieves are caught on camera trying to cash in. The victim in this case helped make this all happen. He owns the Reptile Roadshow, and most of his animals died after a fire. Then police say he was hit by metal thieves. Carla Castaño talked to him today and has more now from Longview. They're just coming in right here to pay, to collect the money. Suspects Jeff Pelham and Jimmy Payne are accused of selling the metal taken from the Reptile Roadshow owner's burned out home. GT Metals and Salvage is just a couple miles away, so when Garth Pitham was burglarized, he thought he'd check in. Turns out the suspects were there. They came in and brought us a load, and uh, meanwhile, you know, the reptile guy, he comes in talking to us and, you know, telling us that he'd been robbed and telling us what he was missing. So well, I walked out back with him, and he, we seen his lawnmower right off the bat. While Garth Pitham called deputies, the buyer stalled. And then I came up here and just kind of you know, held him here. You know, I acted like I didn't have the money and I had to wait for my boss to get here to, until I could pay him. Deputies came and arrested Payne. You can see him on video being taken away in handcuffs. But Pelham, he wasn't arrested until yesterday when he was found in his father's closet by deputies hiding under some clothes. Either way, it's a big relief to those here at the recycling center and to the victim. So they probably went through six or eight hundred dollars worth of lids. Without aquarium lids, many of the animals are now in plastic containers. Pitham says the men also cut the power to his trailer. For tw 20 feet of cable, um, they cut it with my axe, and they took my axe too. <laughs> you know, it was, and it was just, ooh, it was just so frustrating, the whole thing. But he's relieved that his hunch put two suspects behind bars. In Longview, Carla Castaño, Coin 6 News.